Hi guys, today we'll be making geisha pepper sauce. All we are going to do first is to add some vegetable oil in a pot and allow this to eat up. Then we are going to add in our chopped onions. I'm using purple onions, but you can use any onions you like, white onions. To the onions, I'm going to add in some curry masala. I love using curry masala because it has the spices that I really love, but they are kind of scarce to get where I am. Like, you know, it has some rosemary, fenugreek, mm. and all those other delicious spices. Now, we are going to stir this together and allow it to fry for five minutes. The onions has been frying for five minutes. Now I'm going to add in my scotch bonnet peppers. They are roughly blended. I don't want a smooth space now. I want it like this. So we are going to mix this together. Then add in our geisha. I'll be using just a can of geisha. I'm just going to pour it in. In this recipe, you won't be using any tomatoes or bell pepper. That's why it's a pepper sauce. So, if you don't really like pepper, you can skip this recipe. I'm going to add in some seasoning cube and some salt. I'm going to stir this together. But while stirring, I will just use my spoon to mince the fish. I want everyone to be able to get a bite of the fish while it's in the sauce. How are you guys doing? I hope you are doing good. Please, if you like this video, don't forget to click the like button and please subscribe. Thank you. The sauce has been frying for 8 minutes. And believe me, guys, the aroma is everything. So because it's really spicy, I will add in some fresh onions just to reduce the oddness. They are going to stay to combine and allow this to fry for another three minutes. If you are not an onion lover, you can just add in some fresh tomatoes or some bell peppers. That too will be fine. Ta-da! As you can see, our delicious geisha pepper sauce is ready. For real, guys, this smells amazing. And it even tastes more amazing. Can you believe it? So, guys, you really need to try this out. I'm begging you. Like, it goes well with a lot of meal. You can use it with yam. That's what I'll be eating my weight. With uh, rice, spaghetti. But you have to give it a try. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you guys. See you in the next video. Bye.